Okay, moving on to the fourth movie, we have Don't Forget I Love You premiering Saturday, January 22nd, starring Emily Ullerup and Clayton James. I don't know who Clayton James is, but I know who Emily Ullerup is. She is obviously in Chesapeake Shores, and she's done a few fun movies. She did the Ice Hotel one with Kevin McGarry, and then she did one with Chris Russell where they're out in the wilderness. That was really cute. Uh, so I'm going to have to look up who Clayton James is. Let's find out. Okay, I've definitely seen his face before. He's a Canadian actor. Oh, he was on When Calls the Heart. Okay, that's where I've seen him and where probably many of you have seen him. Oh, and he was in The Sweetest Heart, I believe, with, uh, I always want to call him Lucas Bouchard, but it's Chris McNally and Julie Gonzalo. So he's doing some stuff with Hallmark Channel. And I believe there was almost like a possible romance between his character and Kayla's character, Fiona, on When Calls the Heart. But I think they're taking that in the direction of Higgum now. But I'm getting I'm getting off track here. So anyway, Clayton is in this with Emily. And it'll be fun since we haven't seen too, too much of him on Hallmark Channel. I'm excited to see him in this. And here's the description. Taylor opens a time capsule. Ooh, interesting. Left by her late mother, which contains six envelopes. In each one is a challenge that her mother hopes she can complete to push her out of her comfort zone. These envelopes force her to open up herself to the possibility of love. So we have some interesting storylines already. We have the kind of mystery of the veil and the wedding veil series. Then we have these envelopes, kind of a challenge, a mystery around these envelopes. So I like that it's going to add something new to these movies, hopefully, and maybe a, a little interesting dynamic of this mystery and kind of accomplishing the, this goal of opening envelopes and seeing how Emily's character grows as a person. And it may be a bit of a tearjerker. It kind of sounds like with the letters being written to her by her mom, we're going to see some definite uh, emotions there, I'm sure. And Emily is such a great actress. So fun to watch. Also, judging by the photos on this, I feel like there's some fall foliage going on. So... Kind of interesting time in January. I feel like all the, uh, you know, leaves are off the trees by then. But who am I to know these things? Maybe with climate change and global warming, the leaves just don't fall off at the same time they used to. But there's definitely some uh, fall foliage going on. So be sure to check this one out January 22nd.